Want to say hi, hi to the vlog? Yeah. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> I want to show them my toys. You want to show them your toys? Yeah. Okay, you can pick one toy because we got to show them our clothes. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, okay. you want to show you what you made in preschool today? I want to show your Why you do that? Crafts? my sad pony. So. Okay. Okay, go ahead and show them, buddy. This is purple dinosaur. Yeah. It's sharp teeth. Sharp teeth. And it is like... <gasps> Ooh. That's <gasps> kind of scary. And... Hold on. <laughs> and we have green. A frog. A frog. Yeah, it's like... You get, it jumps like this. Hey, hey, that jumps. Wee wee. Ooh, what what sound does a frog make? Ribbit. A ribbit. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. So cute. Now say bye. Now you gotta go back and play in your room, okay? Bye. I love you. Oh, that's <laughs> so, so cute. So sweet, <laughs> <laughs> also, this is probably the start of the vlog. Yeah. Yes, this is the start of the vlog. So I, 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 this feels kind of formal. We did originally do this. We're sitting in front of the window. I hate sitting on the floor, so we moved in here. But I was going to say, look at how beautiful <laughs> my hair extensions are. Mm -hmm. I feel like I look so much more like Emily. I do need to wash them to kind of tone the fake yeah. hair a little bit more. I never liked them at first. Form. They need to be toned. And my hair is like on its last whim. So yeah. I'm getting new hair in a few weeks. So can't wait for that feeling. It's the best. I know. Welcome it's, to the it's club. It's not really the best. It kind of hurts. It feels oh, really it heavy. The first. Yeah, the first. Uh, last night sleeping was kind of hard. I got them literally yesterday. Um, they are beautiful, but yeah, it takes a minute to adjust. Um, yeah, they definitely take some adjusting and I also never wear my hair curled So I feel like I'm going to prom or something or I feel like I'm getting married I think you're gonna look at the footage and realize you like it. It's Maybe. just you're just not used to it Like Abby said today's video is going to be a fun little summer vlog But we wanted to start by showing you guys some cute new pieces we picked up from White Fox Thank you White Fox for sponsoring this video. We absolutely love working with them You guys know this if you aren't new here, but if you are new here we're obsessed with White Fox. Yeah, we are. We're in love. It's like our favorite brand. We wear it all the time. I was going to say we're in a long-term, really healthy relationship with White this Fox. This is the healthiest relationship in mm, most long-term. Like the most ever. loyal, <laughs> yeah. loving relationship ever. And we just feel so grateful. Yeah. So in case you don't know much about White Fox, they're an Australian brand. They offer afterpay to US, New Zealand, and Australian customers. Also Express Worldwide Shipping, which is amazing. We always recommend you guys get Express Shipping if you're mm -hmm. in the States because yes. it could take a while from Australia otherwise. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we have these that don't have papers on your foot in bed. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's embarrassing. It's okay. Oops. Um, um, did you also say our code? We oh. do have a code, besties, McKnight WF, right? Yes. <laughs> McKnight WF, are you sure? Yes. Okay. Change. You just <laughs> never say that part, so you don't know. I know it's you always do the, the, the like the spiel. important things, and then I'm just like here smiling. Yeah. So without further ado, let's get into it because we have a yeah. lot to share. And like I'm usual, I'm sweating. Me too. It's hot. I'm wearing this full sweatsuit right I now, know, which I'm hot. literally obsessed with. We had to get sweatsuits and sweatshirts, sweatshirts, even though it's summer. But that's how obsessed we are with our hoodies and sweatshirts. So. This one is so cute. I love this color. It has this periwinkle blue lettering and on the back too. I just love it so much. So cute. So cute. It's their archive 6.0 collection. I forget the exact name of this, but it will be linked below. I get a medium large in their quarter zips and we're just obsessed with them. Yeah. So cute and comfy. Yeah. And I'm wearing this cute little whole ensemble tracksuit and this beautiful, I love that it's color. called blueberry, but it's like the beautiful, most Stunning it's like a neon blue. bright. Yeah, it's so bright. I love it. And I feel like the camera doesn't even do it justice. I think it does. You it think? looks very bright on camera. Okay. And this is the Archive 6.0 tracksuit in the blueberry color, like I said. I get the hoodie in a small medium. Let me show you the back. Yeah, the both of these hoodies have like the same print on the back. This is like a cute thumbnail moment. I love the back and then it has the matching logo on the sweats. Small in the sweats. This tracksuit is literally so comfy. I could sleep in it. Like you don't even need a comforter <laughs> and your sheets. You could just sleep in this on a couch. If you're going happy. camping this summer. Oh my god. It'd be perfect for camping. <sighs> yes. Yeah. More like glamping. Yeah. I would say this. You'll is be the hottest girl in the campground. So I got a hoodie too which was Really not necessary because it's summer, but at no, nighttime, we do a lot of like bonfires and yeah. even 
um, when we go boating towards the end of the night, we like to throw on a hoodie with our bikini. So that's why I justified it. So this is the offstage hoodie. I got it in a size medium large in the shade Fawn. I don't think I own anything in this shade, but I saw it and I could not pass it up. Mm -hmm. It's like this dark tan khaki color and I'm obsessed. So cute. I have a few other hoodies in this collection and they are very well loved and it was time for a new shade. So yes. love her. Where do I want to begin? I got What's so that many pink tops. Thing? Oh, it's so cute. Okay, just share that. So that? this is like a little <gasps> so cute. kind of like see-through baby pink mini skirt. I got this to wear like as a cover-up with bikinis. Oh my gosh. And I, I thought that. it was so cute. Yeah, I love so cute. Love, love it. Called the Secret Messages mini skirt and a size small. I love that. Color. And I think this would just be so cute over a white bikini. I'll just show the white bikini I got right now too. Um, I've been getting white bikinis every time we work with White Fox because I'm a 2023 bride and my bachelorette trip is coming up. So I just want all the white bikinis, you know. Also for a honeymoon as well. So I got this really cute bikini. So um, the top is called the St. Lucia Bikini Top in a medium. And then these are the Island Hideout Bottoms. Size so small. Yeah, so I'll probably try this on and together. Stretchy, so that's good. Yeah, very comfy. Love that. And I just feel like this, is, this skirt is really flattering too. And one more thing, because it just goes along with those two items. I also got a sarong, just a really pretty white mesh Sarong that says wifey to be in light pink super cute. embroidery. I love um, I, yeah, it's literally perfect and so cute. I cannot wait to wear this on my bachelorette trip. It's just, if you have a bachelorette trip coming up, you need this. And it's really affordable. I think it was like 15 bucks. It'd be a good gift to give too. Yeah, that's true. It would be a really mm -hmm. good gift to give. This next top, I'm really sad to say, does not fit. I tried every angle. It's that material. It doesn't stretch. Way. It doesn't stretch. But this is the Don't Use Me Bustier in Baby Pink. This color, this print, this design is everything. It even has like oh, this is... little corset style back, which I thought I'd be safe getting a small because of this like adjustable back. But... It does not budge, so unfortunately, it doesn't fit. That but I so had to sad. share anyways because I'm obsessed with this top, and it has adjustable straps. I just wish I got it in a bigger size. Next time we work with them, you need to. I ask know. I feel like I might ask for it again, even though like I want it. If you don't, I will. No, I need it because I was <laughs> obsessed. I was like, "Are you kidding me?" It's so cute. So I cute. Know. So so bummed. This doesn't fit. But I had to share for you guys to snag it in the right size. Just size up. In yeah. This top. I kind of got. I got the same material. Um, in a dress and I Is sized it up to a medium and it fits perfect and it's so so, adorable. so cute like how feminine and girly like that's a tea party and I know dress. right <laughs> I've been actually really into kind of like a, a more simple feminine it's girly like European too yeah like, I just picture this in like a huge field of tulips and flowers <laughs> it's just so cute and it's like the pattern which reminds me of our childhood i feel like mm. mom had maybe a tablecloth or something like this oh yeah picnic it's bringing vibes. me back picnic picnic yes yeah it's bringing me back to that but this dress is so stinking cute i did snag a couple going out dresses in case that we go out during abby's bachelorette um we're thinking no clubs but you just never know you never you know. never know so i got this just in case we do hit the club but it's this like lace mesh dress and it has this nude bodysuit bustier underneath sexy. which i thought was sexy and you can see through the bottom so you can kind of see your butt cheeks which is why i would not wear this in my hometown i will only wear this in a no, it needs state. to be out at night you can't wear this well, in the at daytime. night but like also in like scottsdale <laughs> yeah like vegas, vegas miami yeah not yeah. not where i'm gonna know everyone you know right. this is like a who is that girl kind of dress yeah she definitely doesn't live here mm -hmm. um it's called the too close mini dress got a size small um, and yeah, if it's really good, it is a little bit tight, but I would rather this kind of dress be on the tighter side. Mm -hmm. So super sexy. And while I'm here, Abby's having a pink theme night. So this is one of the top contenders for that. This is called the set the scene mini dress. And mm -hmm. it's this really pretty bubblegum pink color. It has this mesh overlay. So it's double lined. It has a zipper up the side and it fits really good. As well as this ruching, and it has this cool little cutout in the but back. But you know, you could probably wear it like that. Oh, maybe uh, the, the back would be a little funky. Maybe It'd be a little like saggy. <laughs> maybe. I know. But we'll give I it a go. Well. We'll give it a go. Okay, another poolside or like beachy cover up. 
so Ooh, cute i love this cute. one yeah this one i am obsessed with the material of this it's just so comfy oh, the front or back? and stretchy this is the front oh okay. and this is the back yeah okay, cool so it's just like a sheer mini dress to you can wear i would wear like a vibrant bikini under this like a neon pink or just right. any neon color would be really so cute, cute under this with neon nails Ugh, it'd be a vibe this is called the Future Lover Long Sleeve Mini Dress in a size small. It fits perfect. It's so flattering. Mm -hmm. And I feel like it's a perfect vacation vibe. I love that. I want that. So I know you do need it. I was surprised this didn't sell out. I was like expecting it to sell out before it came. For so I was sure. so happy that I have that. I love that. So cute. Okay, I got three going out tops. And as you should. Love all three. <laughs> um, I already wore one of them out. I could not wait to wear this one because this is just so easy to style and wear. Mm -hmm. and and I actually, I know this seems like super basic, but I've been looking for a top like this for a while. And this is just such good quality. The thickness. Oh, you didn't wear that on br to brunch? On yeah. Me? Okay. Didn't you think it was cute? Yeah, it was cute. I didn't realize that it was a new top. Yeah. I thought you had that for a while for some reason. No, I feel like I've had something similar, but this one just felt so much better. I just knew. I was like, when I saw it out on the site, I was like, this will be such good quality. So it's super thick and stretchy and comfy and it like sucks you in and I don't know, I just super love cute. it. But yeah, this top never goes out of style and I know Time I'm going to get a lot of wear out of it. The next top is this Ooh. gorgeous white bustier top that so kind of cute. is giving like mermaids. This, this reminds me of like shells. No, it's from really, the beach. It's really bridal to me. You think it's bridal too? Yeah. Oh, yay. Good. So I, love I that always pleated cut. Yeah. I need all the bridal fits. Um, and this is called the Triggered by You Bustier in a size small. And I don't think I've tried this on yet, actually. It better fit because I'll be so sad. <laughs> me too. This is so gorgeous. That's bomb. Well, and it has adjustable straps too, which is always a plus. And then the last one is a black bustier top with just like very minimal black lace on the top of the tatas. And I just love, love the black bustier top. Mm -hmm. You can't go wrong. I love I that. have my collection is growing <laughs> and I am We have a Friday occasion. We're prepared. Yeah, I'm always prepared. So <laughs> This thing look, yeah, because you can wear these with like cargos, leather pants, jeans, whatever. I have two more things to share with you guys. I have a jumpsuit. This is called the Meaning of Love Jumpsuit. Got it in a size small. It's going to be kind of hard to show this if I'm not wearing it, but it's this high neck jumpsuit that has a low back. And it's definitely like for a taller girls. So if you're short, there'll be a lot of material at the end. Obviously, you can get it altered, but that's just kind of a lot of work. I just feel like it's very... Classy, classy yet sexy at the same time yeah. so i actually love this so much it's very thick you're not going to see through it or anything it's very form-fitting and snatching and then to go with that i figured if it was cold at night this would be perfect to go with it and i love leather bomber jackets so that's like my go-to if i don't know what jacket to wear it smells like fish oh my it, god i hate when that happens why leather, does that happen sometimes leather you know, always house. smells like fish not always but a lot of the times um this is the make things right bomber jacket size small medium i actually didn't smell it until you said that but yeah it's the perfect amount of oversized and i just think it's very it's cool it's giving like a motorcycle yeah it's a staple for all seasons i always like think of things like this like courtney kardashian oh yeah for sure yeah. like like that grungy yeah but rich rock star mm -hmm. vibe exactly okay well that is everything, everything that we picked up from white fox Yay. this time around we hope you guys enjoyed that part of the vlog and i hope you guys are excited to see the rest of the vlog we're excited to be you know hanging out with you guys over the I next know. couple days you never It'll vlog with me so i know i'm excited to have abby in the vlog vlogging is a little bit hard i don't know i'm struggling right now with balancing everything in my life like there's personal things going on that like I don't really talk about, but yeah, yeah, I'm like obviously a mom trying to do YouTube, trying to um, be a lifestyle. Yeah, have clients that need me and stuff like that. And so yeah. yeah, it's kind of I'm in that like weird, I'm in a weird phase right now where I'm kind of like neglecting social media, but I don't like that because I feel like social media is just so much fun. Yeah, and. I love it, especially YouTube. Hate, we really yeah. connect with you guys on YouTube. Like, I don't feel a connection on any other platform. Yeah. But YouTube, I love talking to you guys in the comments. I love making videos for you guys. Mm -hmm. I love hearing what you guys have to say. Mm -hmm. And yeah. you guys really do feel like friends. Yeah. So exactly. hi. Bye. Okay. We're not we're not saying bye yet, but almost. Okay, babes. 
Everything will be linked in the description, like I said. And if you guys do decide to shop, don't forget to use our code MCKNIGHTWF. You make me feel so tan. You make me feel so tan. He's actually tan what right now, kind of, too. Okay. You are, like, just been I loving the sun. He's got little freckles. Oh my god, you got the cutest little freckles ever. Love his, I'm so happy you got freckles. You got my makeup on your arm, silly goose. That's what he's trying to avoid. Bruh. <laughs> Bruh. Bruh. Yeah. Tana, how many days do you have left to school before summer? <gasps> Two. What? That's no. it? I mean, oh. four. Yes! Four, four days left. Oh. Four days till summer? That's summer break. Crazy. I'm not ready. Y'all, I'm not ready. Four days is for summer? I am, but I'm not. Four days until, until summer break doesn't mean the and weather's going to be good. then you start big kid school, first grade. Or no, kindergarten. Kindergarten, <laughs> kindergarten at the big kid school. All right. Okay, babes. We hope you enjoyed this part of the video, but we'll see you guys on Friday morning. Abby's about to go pick up her man from the airport, but we're going to be picking up this vlog on Friday for a nice pool day or boating day. We're not sure yet. But we'll see you guys then. Say bye. No, bye. you say bye. Bye. Little kiss. Little kiss. <gasps> oh, oh, do a bad one. Do a nicer one. That's Tatum. Do a nicer one. Aw. <laughs> he loves the camera. He does. He needs his own, he has his own channel. Okay. Well, okay. Here. <laughs> hey, babes. Good morning, babes. Emily and I are about to get ready. And we thought that we would do our makeup with you guys. Yes. We are doing kind of a more, mm, we always say light. I know. Light glam, light, light makeup. Glam. This is the first boating day of 2023. So and exciting. we're so excited. If you guys follow us, like if you follow us over the years, you guys know we love summer, we love boating. Mm -hmm. And I'm just so excited. It's supposed to be clear in 81 today. So it's gonna be a really perfect, perfect, perfect boating day. Weather, yeah. yeah, it's already warm out there and it's only 10.30 a.m. Yeah. What are you moisturizing with? Oh, oh I just, have some Yeah, Summer Fridays lip balm. Okay, so I'm gonna start with my, you know, tried and true flawless filter in 4.5. Okay, I am using the Paula's Choice Youth Extending Daily Hydrating Fluid. Um, it's basically just a sunscreen. It has SPF 50. So I always put that underneath my makeup and then oh, I already put on sunscreen, sunscreen too. I never forget sunscreen. Yeah. I use a PCA sheer tint. This is a product I've been obsessed with recently. Um, heard about it on TikTok as per usual where I get all my product recommendations these days. It's the Natasha Denona Skin Glass. It's a primer serum and it's like this super like glittery almost serum. Ooh. It gives your skin the healthiest looking glow like you just got a hydrofacial or something like it looks so nice have you done it do you want to try mm -hmm. it i already put my flawless filter on is that okay i was gonna use my other primer i've mm -hmm. been loving this primer again this is the rare beauty pore diffusing primer i just love the consistency of this and it, i feel like it hydrates while filling in your pores but not it doesn't make it too like slippery and then i use the elf halo glow this is like a dupe for the Charlotte Tilbury, which I think it is. I'm never gonna buy the Charlotte Tilbury one again. Really? Never. I feel like I couldn't find a, like the shade isn't as good as the Charlotte Tilbury one. Really? I don't like but it. I do still love it. And I'm just priming my eyelids with Tarte Shape Tape. I already primed my eyelids off camera with um, just some concealer and then set it with translucent setting powder. Because I'm not going to do a crazy eyeshadow look today. No, I'm doing very, very minimal, minimal basic eyeshadow too. And we still have to do our try on clips for the White Fox haul. So if our hair looks different, that's why. Um, yeah. <laughs> but I was just having a really bad body image day that day. And it's yesterday? Yesterday and the day before. Mm -hmm. And I'm, it's always when I'm PMSing that I have the worst body image days. Probably because you're extra bloated. And yeah, like I don't know. Sensitive. I don't know. I and I also I'm really hungry when I'm PMSing and like my period's about to come. Like I am ravenous <laughs> and I binge eat every Same. time before my period comes. Same. So I think my period's about to come as well. I'm not even kidding. Yeah, our periods I feel are like so bloated. Up. Um, there's a pill that you can take that stops your period from coming. Like a birth and control. It's not, it's not like the birth control trick that you do. It's like an actual thing that you can order online. 
Oh, really? And it's like, so like, you know how your period always starts before a vacation? Every yeah. time. Or like a wedding or like a big event. That's just how Mother, Mother Nature, Nature likes is. to play. Yeah, she's not very nice sometimes. So, <laughs> but there is a pill. I need to get the link to it. Oh. My hair girl was telling me about it. And, I'm and like, it's not like a prescription? That. It kind of is, but like you don't need a doctor's. Because my like, doctor asked doctor doesn't me need to prescribe it. if I wanted the birth control pill because I just got a refill. If I wanted the pill that gives you no period and I said no because I feel like that's sketchy. Well, it just doesn't feel natural. It's like that can't be good for you. Like your body is meant to secrete that stuff. Can you not say secrete? I mean, <laughs> sorry, I was in nursing classes so I use those kind of terminology words. Yeah. Um, sorry, it's but like it's word. supposed to shed, okay? Yeah. So I don't know. I just there's get a, sketched out by a, that. Yeah, it happens for a reason, for sure. Okay. Um, okay, so I'm gonna do a little bit of underpainting. I have been obsessed cream? with this bronzer stick. This is the LYS cream bronzer stick. Oh, and Meredith was raving about that. Yeah, and then it got it in the shade Harmony. It's super, super creamy and really, really nice. I'm also underpainting with the Makeup by Mario Soft Sculpt Transforming Skin Enhancer in Medium. I like the LYS one better than the um, really? Makeup by Mario one, yeah. Okay, so I'm using the Makeup by Mario Surreal Skin Foundation in 15N. I'm gonna try and use a light layer of this because I don't wanna look too full coverage, <laughs> but it's really hard not to. Yeah. But I wanna test this out on a hot uh, lake day. Yeah, I'm so. honestly, so my experience with that, I love it for the first like four or five hours. <laughs> I'm using the Patrick Ta eyeshadow palette and I just use this. Um, light brown shade right here. That's like all I'm gonna do in my crease and then I'm gonna put I mix this Shimmer and this shimmer together and put that all over my lid. I Know I'm the investing because I always get hormonal acne. That's the only time I get acne mm -hmm. I have like two big zits on the side of my face. So that's cute people have been asking about wedding updates So you should probably give your wedding planning update. Or... I don't really like have one though. Yeah, Abby is like not but Abby and I are both I like this. Not... We're not big planners I, <laughs> I'm not into the whole wedding thing. We're not organized planners. No, which you guys... Honestly, I hate that about us I, I really too. wish we were I hate that about us too, but lucky for me my man takes care of it yeah he's been doing majority <laughs> of the work i'm not even kidding it's so funny to me and but you know i've heard i've talked to another couple where she said the same thing that her husband did everything yeah so i was like okay i'm not alone we love a man who handles business yeah okay. jake just doesn't procrastinate but it really is not going to be bougie like it's actually really not it's pretty like Small and modest like I'm not we're not doing crazy florals. I'm not doing crazy extravagant table pieces and like I don't know crazy fancy food we're having a place called Spiro's cater our wedding which is just like pasta pizza salad pasta salad yeah. Well, honestly, that's what, I don't like the super fancy wedding meals. I, I don't either. I went to one that was like I don't need this either. really fancy salmon and veggies yeah. and I was like this is not what I want right now. Right, I agree. I when, especially when you're drinking, I feel like our majority we want it just to, we want it to be fun. So we're gonna have plenty of alcohol. And once you're like drinking and you're like tipsy or drunk, like you don't want fancy chicken breast and salmon. At least I don't. So yeah. I'm, I'm like, you know, it's for the best. Um, I'm using the NARS Radiant Longwear Foundation, just like one and a half pumps all over my face. I haven't used that in so long. I kind of miss it. It's, it's literally circle back to that one. It's the best. Okay, I'm going to use the Huda Beauty um, Faux Filter Concealer and Coconut Flakes under my eye. And then I'm going to use the Bobbi Brown Concealer in Beige. Like in my T zone. That did not come out like I wanted it to. That was a very thick line, but that's okay. We'll fix it later. While I wait for this to get a little bit tacky, I'm gonna use the Patrick Ta Lamination Brow Gel. I love this stuff. Oh, I just got a new brow product. I'm excited to try it. It's the Fluff Up Brow Wax from Benefit. Ooh, wow. You're always keeping up with the new products. I don't TikTok. know what the heck's going on. It's TikTok. I need to like, I kind of almost wish the app would get banned. I'd save a lot of money. She says that and it pisses me off. I'm like, do not I, manifest that. I'll be so livid. 
I know. No, I actually it. don't want it to get banned, but like I should just delete it. I don't want to ruin it for other people. I just think I need to delete. Yeah? No, you don't. Then again, I love it so much. It's such a love hate. I know. It's just like, I don't know. It's such a good escape from reality. But it's also like. I know it's too much of a distraction though. I know that. Like, yeah. I don't get as much done because of TikTok. <laughs> and it's my fault, not TikTok's fault, but. Right. I have no self-control. Me, me neither. I can scroll for hours. This is my favorite part of my makeup now, is using this Charlotte Tilbury Matte Blush Wand in Peach Pop. It's literally so stunning. Oh, it's so pretty. Uh-huh. Just makes you look so sun-kissed and like fresh and alive. I know, I love that product as well. I have way too many blushes now because of, I'm blaming you, Abby. That is my fault. I did start. <laughs> She's that. always telling me, you need this blush, but you need this blush. And I'm like, do I? And then I'm like, okay, fine. <laughs> and then, you know what? I want to return really bad is this. I don't know if it's too late, though. The Juvia's Place one. They came out with these new ones. I just, it's too pigmented for me. I returned mine, too. Okay, you need to send me the return thing because I can't. It's way too pigmented for me. Yeah. I don't like super high pigmented blush that's yeah not my jam i know i was like really excited for a good dupe and then i tried them and i was like mm -mm. and they kind of broke up my foundation underneath mm -hmm. so the charlotte Tilbury one is just it's way more expensive but it's so worth it just setting my makeup with the laura mercier i like the i like using the laura mercier uh powder when i want my makeup to look more natural the Huda Beauty one I feel like is for like full glam. Oh, I've just been using this one every day. I have been obsessed with this powder. You've probably never tried it, huh? The you Beauty Breaker Flower it. Setting Powder. I can't stop using it. And Abby was so kind and gave me a fresh pink powder puff. How cute are these ones? Mm -hmm. So, so cute. cute. I feel like the camera's not even picking up how cute How are. fluorescent it is, yeah. I'm but this powder is so pink. good. I need everything pink. I don't know how people like Work, have like jobs that they have to go to on really nice days. Oh my gosh as soon as the sun comes out I don't want to work. Well, I like I, I obviously didn't know today was gonna be nice But I don't have any clients today and I'm like sweet. It'd be really tempting to like cancel And, and that's would like do the that, hardest but... part. No, I've never done that But it's so hard like when you do make your own schedule. Yeah, that's why Abby and I like slack in the summer times like every time on our YouTube too we'd be slacking which We're gonna try not to but can't make any promises because we we suck we've in already, the summer. We've already been slacking. I know. Well, I mean, not really me. Yeah, I guess. I guess so. I'm but you also in Vegas. Have... I have this Q and A going up today. But you, you do fun things. I sit at home and work. work. Yeah. Like, no, I, I know. Don't My have life a fun is definitely life. more eventful. I do not have people, but people like to see both. They always say like yeah. they like to see my like fun life and then your like mom life. You know. Mm -hmm. I think even if you just did like a mom life vlog, people would. People would watch you know by the way i just used the house labs um bronzer in medium level five and then i'm gonna go in with the house labs pomelo peach blush i'm using my gucci bronzer oh. been using this bronzer every day lately i want that bronzer so good it's hard to tell with this lighting like how everything's looking i don't know why i know i actually don't really like doing my makeup in natural lighting I hate doing it in natural lighting. I prefer I doing it. I think I'm going to do my brows in there. I can't do it here. Yeah. I'm going to use the Fenty Beauty Highlight in Afternoon Snack and Mo, Mo Honey. I thought it said Mo Money. I just kind of mix the two. Oh my god, this is a lot of makeup, I'm realizing, but whatever. It's so hard, especially when you're filming. I get way more carried away for filming. Oh yeah, same. Because then well, it, on I camera, know. it doesn't like show up as well. well and we're filming a well, try on. Well, and we might have to take Instagram pictures today too. Oh, shoot. I forgot about that. You're right. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, what was that? Oh. oh. Oh, hell no. If the power goes out, I'm going to cry. Why would the, why would the power go the out? The power went out yesterday thing? for no reason. Unless someone hits like the pole. But I feel like you guys <gasps> always have issues with your power. We do. Power Always. Does. So bizarre. I'm also going to use the House Labs Pomelo Peach Blush on top. It is so pretty. This is definitely a blush that is worth your money, I think. Yeah, it is stunning. For the amount of product you get, I know it's pricey, but totally worth it. Yeah, I love it. Okay, we just finished our makeup. I feel like now you guys can kind of see 
Let's see if full it's glam. I definitely did full glam. Yeah, I feel like I didn't do super full glam, but I don't know. I feel like mine the camera looks, makes it look a little bit more. Mine looks more full glam because yeah. I did like a shadow liner underneath. Oh yeah. And just gonna tell you guys our lip combo because we always forget and we always get comments <laughs> on it. So. Um, I'm using the Kylie Coconut Lip Liner and Too Faced Child Star. Sorry, you're gonna hate me. Um, I use NYX New Truffle, like, that's pretty much always a lip liner I have on. NYX New Truffle, Too Faced Child Star, and then the Huda Beauty Staycation on top. So yeah, this is the finished look. I actually really like it though. I do it think really it's really beachy. I think what makes mine not look so uh, full glam is I don't have like dark shadow underneath or mascara. Um, did both. I don't know, I've been liking not doing like um, shadow and mascara, but. Yeah, it does make you look more like youthful. Yeah. I feel like this makes me look a little bit older and more like sultry, you know? <laughs> okay, anyway, we're gonna go ahead and do the try on clips now. Yeah, we gotta film our try on clips and then the fun starts. Yes, the fun will begin. Well, and we gotta get Instagram pictures, which I don't really know what I'm gonna wear yet in Instagram Same. pictures, but I might just do that later because, yeah, I don't know. All right, follow us on Instagram. <laughs> okay, we're gonna do a little quick. Fit check. Boat day, O-O-T-D. So, Emily, what are you wearing? So, this bikini, white fox. Skirt is also white fox. This is new. So cute. But I got this skirt last year, so I don't know if it's still on their website or not, but they have the best cover-ups. Yeah, so. they do. You guys already saw this stuff in the haul, so you guys probably already see this coming. But, white fox bikini, and then white fox little skirt. Well, this one's from so a few cute. hauls ago. But I love yeah. the texture of this top, show them. It's yeah. like super it's beachy. very beachy. I know, I'm like we're going to the lake, but whatever. We might actually go to my uh, pool because we have to wait for Igor. Yeah, we're waiting He's on He's gonna these. hit some traffic. But maybe we should make a little, um, instead of like, you know how Graydon is shower quacky. <laughs> oh my God, we love Graydon on TikTok. Graydon on TikTok we're TikTok is so funny. He makes these shower cocktails. I'm like, should we make a pool cocktail? Let's make a pool cocktail. Let's make a pool cocky. Let's do it. What do you have? Um, Tito's, of course. Well, Tito's. Okay, what do we have? We're gonna also do like our pool day essentials or lake day essentials, like beauty things that we take with us on the boat. Yeah. We're extra. I got my little stuff right here. I need to get a new beach bag. I already have one in my cart that I really want, but um, I ordered we'll do a, a what's in our. You ordered a a frotta. I ordered. I caved. I got my first DH gate bag and I only did it because it was a beach bag. I'm like, I refuse to spend $2,000 on a beach bag yeah. that you take to the beach to get sand and, and water and spill shit in. It's so true. So that's the only well, how, way I got how to get a DH gate bag. It was often, still 250 bucks, not cheap. So. No, but I was going to say, how often do we even go to the beach? We never go to the beach. Um, we go boating, but so we don't go to the beach. I got some low calorie pink lemonade. That sounds good. Yeah. Organic. Ooh. Organic. Perfect. Also, I think I should bring, I did bring or buy a couple snacks from Trader Joe's. Don't look at this. <gasps> I Don't forgot. Look at this. I forgot to grab salami. Do you have salami by chance? Yay. Dang it. I'm really, salami is a boating day like essential or like just meats and cheeses I feel well, like are really good. Bring these. these are some good summer snacks. These. Are delicious. No, the patio chips from Trader Joe's. Yeah, are I should have brought pickle, the pickle. Orange, yeah, pickle chips. Oh. They are really good. I'm so sick of them though. I've already bought I'm two bags. Like this for week. Igor. So I'll bring them. I don't know if you like these. Maybe actually. Chile spiced mango. A uh, sweet and dried mango with chili seasoning. Yum. Is it Chile or chili? Chili. I would. I don't know. I don't know. So that's Who what knows? we're gonna bring. But. Let's make a quacky. Let's do it. Is that necessary to like? Yes. Yeah, okay. Shake. We love our little. I see there's like barely any left. I know. And so I was like, I made some yesterday because I knew we might be oh. making some drinks today. But this is the best ice. Yeah. Oh my god. So good. So satisfying. Okay, so this is obviously not gonna be anything fancy. I really wish that we had some lime juice to make it better. Lime, yeah, fresh limes, or lemons even, or Sprite. Okay, so I'm gonna grab a handful. It's not okay, it's just us. <laughs> and vodka kills bacteria, so it's fine. <laughs> Does it? <laughs> yes. Um, two shots of vodka. Mm. That's good. More? Mm, a little For bit. For good measure. Yeah. Okay. Then, I mean, I could have made an espresso martini. No, I that's not the vibe today. I guess you're right. That's, that's like too, that's for a nighttime beverage. 
Okay. Is that it? Is that all we're doing? Yeah, I'm just gonna like make it chilled, extra cold. Mm -hmm. It's really hot out there. I don't know if this is closed all the way and I'm a little scared. <laughs> we're wearing white, it's the worst time. Like, this is what I was afraid of, it not opening. I cut my fingers so I oh, can't like here. go. This is the summer, guys. <laughs> I'm scared it's gonna be so strong. I already know. I'm scared to try this. You can't taste the vodka. Really? Yeah, it's pretty good. Oh, I'll take it then. Yeah. All right, let's go to the pool. I hope you guys can hear us, but um, we're gonna get, get copyright. Um, here's some pool day essentials. So we got some hair oil, Dior lip glow oil, of course, tanning oil. This has SPF 50. Love this stuff. It has like a sparkle to it too, and it smells good. Sun bum, trucker hat. You know the vibes. And of course, the portable charger. Abby and I are laughing because she's really giving Sharpay Evans. <laughs> Literally. Goodbye, clouds. Okay. Hello, says the blue. A dip in the pool. A trip to the spa. The whole world according to Mwang. That's why we never pursued singing. But yes. Yeah, I'm just Sharpay. Like my Sharpay Evans. Yes, love it. Love Look it. who's here! Really red, white. Every time I get this cooler out, I remember when I had those yes. acrylic nails and it broke two of my acrylic that nails. Was oh my god, that hurts so bad. Ooh, got the good. Eager wants blue res. <laughs> Better than peach. Better than peach. It's actually firm. Yeah. Here's. It's a mess back there. You wanna jump in? Just close your mouth, okay? Keep your mouth closed if you jump in. <laughs> oh, the Loch Ness Monster over there. Go! We're on a nice day.